Hey there, everybody. Welcome in. We're going to do just a little playthrough today of Dungeon Drafters, which is a game by Manolith Studios. Uh, you heard that right. The text there, it looks like Monolith almost, but it's Manolith Studios. It's a Brazilian team. Seven people are on it. Eight if you count their cat, which is kind of fun. Uh, but this is just a short video where I'm just going to go through a solid game or two of this so you can see what it's like. Um, now you've got your how to play and I can talk a little bit about, you know, your cards are there. Card description actually will pop up down here and they're pretty good at describing what happens. There'll be icons and they don't really explain the icons a whole lot. Hopefully in the, the full game, they will. Uh, you've got a deck, which is right there and you've got a, a graveyard for your cards, a card grave. Once a card goes into this grave, there's no getting them out until you reach a shrine. Uh, through that. You've got action points down here at the bottom. Those action points, you get three moves per turn. It can be a move, a melee attack, or it could be the use of a card, either way. And then you've got your health right here. Uh, so that's everything you really need to know getting into it. Uh, okay, we've shuffled everything in. We've got our cards, but right now uh, there's no enemies. As you can see, you hit these barrels things hide. These plants here, uh, they give you health. So I'm actually not going to loot those plants yet. All right, first battle, play your turn. So you can click and see like this dragon's gonna hop and it's gonna move around. We don't, we're not sure exactly where, probably toward the character. Um, and then you've got this uh, slime remnant, which can uh, pursue and bump. So it, it'll bump you and hurt you. This one I know can do some range damage. I'm not sure why. I think it's just planning to, to hop. Uh, but anyways, I'm not sure why the attack is listed if it's not planning it or why, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Uh, my cards, I've got Quake. It'll inflict three damage to grounded units or one damage to flying units, which is kind of nice uh, that flying units still get hurt. Uh, fireball, it kind of shoots and then it spreads out. So like if I select it and click there, you can kind of see the arrows of the X's. It'll actually split. Um, it's kind of cool. Lightning will hit and then when it kills, well, it's a shot that does two damage. It inflicts two damage close to it and might trigger a chain reaction. So I've cleared uh, a room or two now uh, doing that and then Frog the weak. Anything you hit turns into a frog. So that's what we've got right now. I'm not in a position to hurt these uh, these little boogers. So let's uh, let's get into position to do something. Now I could cast that, and because of the vertical shots it does, it does do a damage. But it's kind of protected. The false dragon, I don't understand. I'll do damage to it, but it won't actually take the damage. And I'm not sure if there's anything that explains that. You know, it could be, um, oh, see, it's gearing up for its water jet attack. It could be something about that monster, but I'm, I'm just not sure. Uh, but let's do reactive spark because we've got both enemies grouped up. So it'll do damage to both of them, I think. Yep, there you go. So pretty painless first round. We didn't lose any health. Only two cards in our graveyard. I think that's pretty cool. Um, maybe I'll take one step closer. God, four damage is such a good, such a good card. I want to save it. So I think what I might do, I don't know if it counts as a flying unit. It does. That's fine. We did that and then we'll frog the weak. So that'll prevent it from doing any further, you know, damage to me. Now frogs always run away, but here's the cool, oh. I was gonna say, here's the cool thing. Um, it's got two health left. We can teleport. You can teleport anything on the map, by the way. You can teleport yourself. 
with this relocate spell or an enemy. Um, oh, it's already got three health back. Maybe we do use a bolt. Oh, it must have had two. Okay. Well, five cards down. More cards than I really wanted to use for this, honestly. Check for goodies. I don't know why. I love getting the gold, even though in the demo you really can't use it. Ah, okay, Killer Blossoms. They will root you. Uh, so if you watch my demo review, they'll actually prevent you from moving. But you can see where their attacks are. So if I keep moving, they actually can't hurt me. What I might do... Honestly? These suckers are real annoying. So what I... Hmm... Okay, so we killed that one. That one should shoot beyond me. I found the way to escape their seed bombs. Oh, nope. So now I'm rooted, right? Um, and I can't, I can't move. I'm pressing buttons. Like you can see, I'm pressing buttons. Um, can we teleport away? <gasps> no, we're rooted. We can't teleport away. Um, this says passive, can't move or teleport end of turn single discard so it doesn't really tell you but if you click on it and then click on yourself you get rid of it and now i can actually just teleport right here and i'm ready they can't move they're rooted also i mean just by nature of being a plant it missed me because it was planning for me to be there um i've got seven cards i could just melee attack and that'll get rid of them. And we did take one damage, so I'm gonna run up here, get one health. I y'all, I've played this demo so much. I am in love with this. Um, Weird Little Indies is sort of going in a new direction where I want the channel to focus on upcoming indies more and stuff that I think is really polished that looks really promising. Um, and, and just news about those games. You know, once I report on one, I kind of want to follow it to launch. Uh, and Manolith Studios seems so cool. I really am enjoying this. The room we just went into is a shrine room. So uh, that will heal me for 10 with uh, this statue I'm standing behind. And this one will shuffle my deck. I don't want to use those right now because I still got like 20 some cards. Oh, four of them. I hate these enemies. These are the ones I hate the most. Maybe the dragon, too, if I'm honest. All right, I got an idea. I have an idea. We're going to teleport me there, and then we're going to inflict three damage to all of these. So that's going to get rid of them. And then we'll start moving closer to this enemy. Seed bomb, but I'm way gone from there. No, I don't want to use it. I think I could get through this without using any more cards. It, you gotta be careful, though, because he could root me, right? And then... You know, I, I'm real. I'm much slower. Well, there we go. Uh, no damage. Virtually painless. I feel like an expert at this. Oh my god. We're doing well. Okay, so I had to learn something here. This lock up here is like a puzzle lock, and these balls right here, these flying bowls. Uh, you have to damage all of them to unlock this this lock up here and that will give you presents and, and cash and stuff um so nothing's too bad in this room i want to take out this thing this is going to summon a bunch of 
they're 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 annoying, but they're not they're not that bad. And actually, I think we'll just uh so yeah, I don't know if this enemy is bugged. It's got a little plus symbol over the health, so maybe it's like armor. Okay, this bomb beetle. It explodes if it's near you. So I think... Well, you know what? Let's just... Oh, okay. It's got actually four health. But this bomb beetle's gonna explode. We're gonna take damage from it. Um, but so will this little guy, the false dragon. And we destroyed the third or the second bowl. So now we just got one more to go. I'm gonna focus on these before killing off any of these. Um, and just to save time, we're gonna we're gonna teleport. Please don't gus me right there. I don't want this one, this ancient shaman, to use a gust cliff. Or... Dang it! I think I'm just gonna take the hit, y'all. I'm just gonna take the hit. Alright, so now that's gonna be unlocked for us. Um, we took a- we'd wasted cards, we've, we've just... Listen, we've wasted a lot of time. It's smart of them to blink away, because I can't use the bomb beetle to to kill it. However, I can do that. And then we'll go up one. We'll wait for this. This is the last one. We've unlocked the puzzle room, so we're we're good there. Now, do I waste a card or do I take a damage? Oh, actually, we don't want it to explode and kill the health fruit. So we're gonna we're gonna let this go one more turn. Oh, you you know what? We'll cast this, it'll cast a copy of that. And then honestly, I just want to end my turn. Ah! We charmed it, it still hurt us. I should have not. I didn't mean to bump into it. But charming it, if there's only charmed enemies, it ends the battle. Uh, let's see if we can find some more health fruit. There, look, we've got it right here. We're back to full health. Um, I usually wait to reshuffle until I'm about halfway through. Um, we'll just collect our treasure. So you can get starter cards, you can get shards, all sorts of good stuff. Uh, and it's satisfying breaking those barrels. Anyways, that's the game. Uh, and as you can see here, we are returning back to town. Um, we have five health. I think in the full game, you'd have an option to go down another floor, but we do not. Um, and I probably, I probably, if this was a full game and I could go down, I'd probably reshuffle and go get the other health fruits I missed. Um, but you can see current spoils. We've got starter pack of auspice, recommended booster pack for aspiring drafters, often drops basic simple cards. Here may be flavor text. So, you know, it's still in development, uh, coming out early next year. Well, first half of next year. I shouldn't say early. Nothing's official yet, but that's Dungeon Drafters. Uh, if you haven't already, go ahead and check out the review I did of Dungeon Drafters. I'll put the, the link here at the end of the video. Uh, and for more things indie, for more things upcoming indie, stay tuned. Talk to you later. Bye, y'all.